other results that we might be interested in, in looking at is perhaps the force reaction. This is a good way to check that your applied load balanced appropriately at the boundaries. So under probe, we click on the force reaction and we click on fix support and other one that we can add to check our analysis is perhaps the force reaction along the contact interface. To do this we first go to tools and contact tools and under scoping method we're going to change this to worksheet and we're going to look at both of them. So we click on apply and under contact we're going to look at pressure. We might also be interested in looking at the penetration. The penetration is penetration between these two bodies. Now of course this doesn't happen in reality but in numerical analysis, in finite element analysis, this does happen and a way to minimize this is again by changing the contact settings and the normal stiffness factor. You can make this smaller and smaller. Now with the stiffness factor of 1, there's not going to be much significant penetration, so this will probably be fine. So we click on solve. Now this should take a very short amount of time because all it's doing is just doing the post-processing. It already solved for the nodal displacement field, so that's why it doesn't take that long. We can look at the pressure along the contact interface. 